Shadow Chronicles, The Untold Tales of Five Enigmatic Creatures, Part 2. Welcome back, explorers, to another fascinating journey through the realms of folklore and legend. In this installment, we delve into the mysterious and chilling stories of five enigmatic creatures from around the world. Brace yourselves as we uncover the secrets of these mythical beings, each more terrifying than the last. Peru. Pishtaco. A chilling exploration of Peruvian folklore's most feared figure, the Pishtaco. Described as a pale-skinned, ominous foreigner haunting the misty peaks of the Andes, the Pishtaco strikes fear into the hearts of travelers with its gruesome legend. Legend has it that the Pishtaco lurks along treacherous mountain paths, preying upon unsuspecting wanderers with its insatiable hunger for human fat. Tales speak of its sinister methods, luring victims with promises of safety before swiftly dispatching them and harvesting their adipose tissue for unknown, nefarious purposes. But the Pishtaco isn't confined to mere legend. Reports dating back centuries detail horrifying encounters with this spectral entity, with some claiming to have witnessed its ghastly form stalking the remote Andean trails. One harrowing account tells of a group of hikers who ventured into the mist-shrouded peaks, only to be pursued relentlessly by a pale figure with eyes as cold as death itself. As the sun dipped below the horizon, the hikers found themselves ensnared in a deadly game of cat and mouse, their screams echoing through the silent mountains. Only through Sherlock did they manage to escape with their lives, forever haunted by the memory of their brush with the Pishtaco. So, dear viewers, heed this warning as you traverse the rugged terrain of the Peruvian Andes. You are the pale stranger who lurks in the shadows, for the Pishtaco may be closer than you think. Turkey Jinn In Islamic tradition, the jinn are supernatural beings crafted from smokeless fire. These elusive creatures possess the power of shape-shifting and have been said to walk among us, hidden from sight yet ever watchful. Let us delve deeper into the world of the jinn and uncover the tales that have captivated generations. The stories of the jinn are as varied as they are chilling. From ancient texts to modern urban legends, these beings have left their mark on cultures around the world. One particularly haunting tale comes from the desolate deserts of the Arabian Peninsula. It is said that a group of travelers ventured into the vast expanse of the desert, unaware of the dangers that lurked in the shifting sands. As night fell and the cold grip of darkness enveloped the landscape, the travelers sought refuge in the ruins of an ancient city. Little did they know, they had stumbled upon a place of great power and great danger. For within those crumbling walls dwelled the jinn, ancient guardians of forgotten realms. As the travelers settled in for the night, they were unaware of the malevolent presence that watched them from the shadows. Throughout the night, strange occurrences plagued the camp. Supplies vanished without a trace, and eerie whispers echoed on the wind. Some claimed to have seen figures moving in the darkness, their eyes glowing with an otherworldly light. By morning, the travelers were shaken but alive, their encounter with the jinn etched into their memories forever. It serves as a chilling reminder of the unseen forces that lurk in the darkness, waiting to ensnare the unwary. A Real-Life Jinn Incident While many dismiss the tales of the jinn as mere superstition, there are those who claim to have encountered these mysterious beings in the flesh. One such account comes from a remote village nestled in the mountains of Turkey. Residents of the village speak of a series of strange incidents that occurred over the course of several weeks. Livestock went missing, crops withered overnight, and eerie sounds filled the night air. Some even claim to have seen shadowy figures moving among the trees, their forms shifting and changing like smoke in the wind. Despite efforts to explain away the phenomena, the villagers remained convinced that they were being haunted by the jinn. To this day, the events remain unexplained, serving as a sobering reminder of the mysteries that lie beyond our understanding. Canada Wendigo 
The Wendigo is a malevolent spirit that haunts the frozen wilderness of North America, striking fear into the hearts of those who dare to venture too far into the winter's embrace. Join me as we explore the dark legend of the Wendigo and uncover the truths that lie hidden in the snow. The legend of the Wendigo is as old as the forests themselves, passed down through generations of indigenous peoples who have called these lands home for millennia. Among these ancient tales, one story stands out as a chilling reminder of the horrors that lurk in the shadows. It is said that long ago, during a harsh winter famine, a group of hunters became stranded in the wilderness without food or shelter. Desperate and delirious with hunger, they made a fateful decision to turn to cannibalism, consuming the flesh of their fellow men to survive. They had become Wendigos, cursed beings consumed by an insatiable hunger for human flesh. No longer bound by the laws of nature, they roamed the wilderness, preying on unsuspecting travelers and leaving nothing but death and despair in their wake. For centuries, the legend of the Wendigo has struck fear into the hearts of those who call the North American wilderness home. Even today, there are those who claim to have encountered these ravenous monsters in the depths of the forest, their howls echoing through the night as a warning to all who dare to venture too far from safety. A Real-Life Wendigo Incident while skeptics may dismiss the tales of the Wendigo as mere myth and superstition, there are those who claim to have encountered these terrifying creatures in real life. One such account comes from the frozen tundra of northern Canada. In a remote village nestled among the snow-covered pines, residents speak of a series of strange disappearances that occurred during the harsh winter months. Locals whispered of shadowy figures stalking the outskirts of the village, their eyes burning with an otherworldly hunger. Despite efforts to explain away the phenomena as the work of wild animals or harsh weather conditions, the truth remains shrouded in mystery. Some believe that the Wendigo still prowls the forests of Canada, waiting for unsuspecting victims to satisfy its never-ending hunger. Norway Draugr In Norse mythology, the Draugr is a fearsome reanimated corpse bound to its burial mound and treasure hoard for all eternity. Join me as we delve into the depths of this ancient legend and uncover the truths that lie hidden beneath the frozen earth. The legend of the Draugr dates back to the time of the Vikings, when tales of these undead guardians struck fear into the hearts of seafarers and warriors alike. It is said that the Draugr were once powerful chieftains and warriors who met a dishonorable end, condemned to wander the earth as restless spirits. Bound to their burial mounds and treasure hoards, the Draugr possess superhuman strength and the ability to shapeshift, making them formidable adversaries to anyone who dares to disturb their slumber. They are said to rise from their graves at night, prowling the darkened forests and rocky shores in search of unsuspecting victims to add to their cursed ranks. Those who encounter the Draugr are said to be struck with fear, their hearts pounding in their chests as the chilling presence of these undead beings washes over them. With their glowing eyes and rotting flesh, the Draugr are a terrifying sight to behold, instilling terror in all who cross their path. For centuries, the people of Norway have whispered tales of the Draugr, passing down stories of their exploits from generation to generation. And while many dismiss these tales as mere superstition, there are those who claim to have encountered these fearsome creatures in the flesh, their lives forever changed by the encounter. A real-life Draugr incident One such account comes from the rugged coastline of Norway, where fishermen speak of a series of strange occurrences that have plagued their village for centuries. According to legend, a group of sailors stumbled upon an ancient burial mound while seeking shelter from a fierce storm. Unaware of the dangers that lay hidden within, they foolishly decided to explore the mound in search of treasure. But their greed would be their undoing, for as they entered the darkened chamber, they disturbed the slumber of the Draugr that dwelled within. What followed was a night of terror unlike any other, as the sailors were hunted relentlessly by the vengeful spirit of the Draugr. Some managed to escape with their lives, but others were not so lucky, their bodies never to be seen again. To this day, the villagers speak of the cursed burial mound, 
warning all who dare to venture near of the dangers that lie hidden beneath the earth. And those skeptics may scoff at their tales, the fear in their eyes tells a different story. South Africa Tokalash In Zulu folklore, the Tokalash is a malevolent spirit, feared for its small, imp-like appearance and its penchant for causing chaos and harm. Join me as we explore the origins of this enigmatic creature and the real-life encounters that have left communities living in fear. The legend of the Tokalash has been passed down through generations in South Africa, with tales of its mischievous and malevolent nature striking fear into the hearts of all who hear them. Described as a small, humanoid creature with a large head and sharp teeth, the Tokalash is said to be summoned by witch doctors to wreak havoc upon their enemies or those who dare to cross them. According to legend, the Tokalash is most active at night, slipping into homes under the cover of darkness to terrorize unsuspecting victims. It is said to possess supernatural abilities, allowing it to move through walls and evade capture with ease. Those unfortunate enough to encounter the Tokalash speak of its chilling laughter and piercing red eyes, which seem to pierce the soul with their malevolent gaze. For centuries, tales of the Tokalash have been used to instill fear and maintain order within communities, with parents warning their children to behave or risk falling prey to the creature's wrath. And while many dismiss the Tokalash as mere superstition, there are those who claim to have encountered the creature firsthand, their lives forever changed by the experience. A Real-Life Tokalash Incident One such account comes from a small village in the heart of South Africa, where residents speak of a series of unexplained events that have plagued their community for years. According to local legend, a family fell foul of a powerful witch doctor who called upon the Tokalash to exact his revenge. What followed was a night of terror unlike any other, as the family was tormented by the malevolent spirit of the Tokalash. Furniture was overturned, strange noises echoed through the house, and the family reported feeling an overwhelming sense of dread that seemed to permeate every corner of their home. Despite their best efforts to banish the creature, the Tokalash continued to haunt the family, leaving them living in fear for their lives. To this day, the village speaks of the night the Tokalash came, a chilling reminder of the power of belief and the enduring legacy of folklore in shaping our perceptions of the world around us.